help Biafra. This is Biafra Liberation Army Network coming to you again. Please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. <laughs> we'll be telling you that Fulani are the same. Mm. Even the ones that call themselves Christians, they know what they are doing. Right? Hardly you see a Christian Fulani man. Hardly. And the type of Muslim they practice is not even the type that others practice. Yes. This is Sheikh Husani, the uniform of Mieti Allah. They are all in the same game. That is why when they kill, you don't hear any of them condemn killings. No. They are doing the same thing. The bead of the master. Someone never said, who, guess who? Guess who this? Is uh, Sheikh Hussani, the smooth ICC political activist. Smooth one. Intelligent one. Yes. That will smooth talk you into relaxing that we are in one Nigeria. You know, one Nigeria is what they are using to come against you in diverse ways. Yes. Believing in one Nigeria is believing in your downfall. Is believing in Islamization agenda which they are not ready to back down. Yes. They are not ready. Not today, not tomorrow, not forever. They are not ready. And they are all willing in the game together because when they subdue land, they will be richer. Sheikh Hussani will be richer. His children will be richer. So they are in the same game of, uh, you know, taking over what does not belong to them in the name of One Nigeria. Without this name, One Nigeria, ask me what will make somebody from Sahel to come to Southeast and carry God and go scot free. Tell me, ask me what would have brought that. The only thing that is bringing that is One Nigeria. Yes. And we must have to stop them. That's why, with wisdom, you have to run for your dear life. I said, I jing ganga, wara if you're so. Nganga kareji, wara if you're so. I will mean, ganga, wara if you're so. You have to run. If not, car will smash you. It has weight. Fulani has weight. And they have supporters. And these are ISIS. Yes, they are like Hamas that wanted to crumble down Israel for what their eyes you see is <laughs> bigger than them because God is with Israelite. Likewise, God is with their friends in the world in general. Why do I say so? Is because God has never left us without a leader. Without somebody that will be kicking 100% against Islamization and Fulanization. Starting from Let's Odimogu Ojuku, our hero. And then down to Owazrike, but that one sold off. <laughs> down to Nambekano, who refused to sell off despite his own suffering. Yes. And now to Simon Eber who is doing exactly what I see in this guy. Maybe you guys are not seeing it. This same thing he's doing was the same thing as Nam Dekan was doing for Ndebo. And that was why our voices were, were very loud. At least you will know our stand. We don't buy everything that is dished out in Nigeria because it's Islamization agenda. So, that is the guy, a, a child that doesn't have wisdom. When you speak on behalf of that child and something happens, the person will not value it. You will not say, is it not just that talk? But when you don't do that, just talk. <laughs> While I will be, be will before that child. That's exactly what is going on in Ebola land. They don't know what it means. To do this exposure, you know, exposing Nigerian army, exposing Nigerian police, the northern politicians, telling you connect to dot to dot, 
what what they are doing is meaning or what it means you have to be connecting dots in order to make a diagram if you don't connect dot to dot you can't make a beautiful diagram so it takes wisdom to connect dot to dot and that's exactly what uh, Simon Eppa is doing to you or for you this Sheikh Hussani to some people they'll tell you he's a Christian he's from Kaduna he's Christian but look at him wearing admiring doing the same thing with heads men <clears throat> all of them are headers they have cows and they are the ones that support cows moving from one area to the other provided their cows eat very well and eat fat so that they will sell it and make money so this is the same thing hovering and rigmaroning about that is why we say be wise you have to be very very wise that's how they go about killing indigenous people in the name of one nigeria <laughs> and we ask people how long will you be deceived how long because i had a video i just listened to a video that they said the full name they requested that every Funani in major cities should go, that they want to do their general jihad in Jos, in Kaduna, and in other parts. They say in Nigeria put together. Who are the people do, uh, you know, discussing this? National television. For you to think it is uh, fake news or content curators like you co fondly call us content curators and yet what we are saying is what is happening you see so this one that name that simon eba called this man corporate icc political worker <laughs> corporate man smooth one <laughs> Looking at him, you say hey, he's a Christian. So anything he signs, you would think he's a Christian that signed it. They are the same, in essence. That's what we're saying. That name Nigeria has ever remained a scam. And it is still a scam till today. Even this time around, it's worse. The worst kind of scam one can ever think of. Imagine holding regions together with falsehood imagine killing them with the name one nigeria that's falsehood that's calm all right who will save the ones they have killed and the ones they've not killed who will still save them because the nigerian army has refused to work against these people they are brothers they are muslim brothers they are these brothers they are that brothers wow you can see there's no hope in Nigeria. Divide Nigeria to save lives. Let every dick, Tom and Harry, hurry for self-referendum. Sign and register. Let's see the next thing that will happen. Thank you very much for your time on this very channel. God bless you all.